What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. So, I have built the UCS Razor Crest. Wow, this is incredible. So it is Sunday and on Friday night I decided, or like even last Monday whenever I got this set, I was like, alright next weekend like I just want to get it done because this weekend I didn't have anything to do. I was like it's a perfect time to just chug along and get it done. Um, I didn't even know if I'd get it done this weekend, so Friday night, um, I started building at around 7 p.m., and I finished at 11.30, roundabout, and I got through 10 bags, so got a pretty big chunk done that night, and then yesterday, I just built from morning to night, you know, I, I had breaks, obviously, in between and stuff. It wasn't like a constant, you know, full day build, but it was like throughout the day I was just chugging along and I ended up building 17 bags yesterday and then that left me with nine bags to go today and I went to church this morning, came home and just got it done and <laughs> it is incredible. It is humongous. Yeah, really, really dope. Um, the crazy part is, these engines, so obviously, like, th this part, if you've seen reviews, it comes out in one big piece, like, the engine part. Um, that was, like, a good, probably, like, ten bags was just the engines. It's crazy. And here it comes over here. It's just so incredible. It is, it's huge. Like, I don't even know. Yeah, it's... It's just, it's absolutely gigantic. And to think a week ago, like a week ago, if I were to fast forward to now and see this here, I would just not know it. It's humongous. <coughs> it is humongous. And I just cannot believe it. I still cannot. I can't believe it. So yeah, it probably took me around uh, 16 hours to build maybe 18 but yeah I, I got it done today I, I i got it done in this weekend which i'm really happy about the first night of building i was like dang i really don't know if i'm gonna be able to get it done this weekend but luckily i was and actually a little bit ago i put the uh razor well here i'll just show you guys what i did I, i've seen a lot of people do this but here is the razor crest the original razor crest play scale model and it's kind of like a trend for people to do this, but you just place it right. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> look at that! Holy crap! Here, look. That's insane. So yeah, um. But I was kind of just rem reminiscing about this set because for those of you who don't know, which is all of you, because I've never actually mentioned it, but the Razor Crest was, th this set in particular, was the first large set that I had got um, back in 2020 that really catapulted me back into LEGO Star Wars collecting. I've always collected LEGO, you know, and, but there was like a good three years that I just wasn't really collecting it anymore, you know. I still had my Lego. I just really wasn't buying it. And whenever I saw that the Final Force Battle Pack was coming out, it really just brought my love for clones and Lego back. And whenever, or I watched Mandalorian and I loved it. So whenever I saw that the uh, Razor Crest was coming out, I was like, oh, you know, I, I gotta get it. Um, and basically, what is that bang? Um, yeah, so basically I was able to get it about a month after it released. I think it released in, like, October or something. And I got it, and after I was done building it, I was like, wow. I, I remember just looking at it and thinking, like, that's such a huge set. And then to fast forward two years later to this is just crazy. It's kind of like a full cir circle moment in a way. But yeah, so for those of you wondering where I'm going to put it, I'm planning on moving Ross Isley and putting it there but also 
my I I my mom suggested like why not? Oh, see I I don't know what I'm doing now. I have so many ideas. We'll we'll see what I end up moving. We'll we'll see what happens because now now that I'm thinking about it, you know, might as well keep all my main like big Star Wars sets in one table. You know. Okay, so so I'm gonna come up with a place to put everything and I'll update you guys whenever that's the word. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.